setting up a business part one this is a general overview for anyone who's thinking of setting up a business I'm gonna do a few videos on the subject so that people can uh, follow the steps that are necessary in order for them to set up a business so the first thing you need to do is identify what your particular skill or specialism is what you're selling what it is you want people to buy from you that's the very first step knowing what you're good at where your skills and talents lay whatever the business is you want to set up it must align with your skill set second once you know what you have to offer for people to buy you must do a business plan because your business plan sets out all the factors you need to consider before you open any business and any business plan must include your strategy in order to generate income so who are your potential customers what is your pricing strategy who are you competing with what is your marketing or your sales strategy you see a business plan is fundamental and these are the different sections that must be included in any plan so first you have the business idea um, what business is it you want to set up is it a barbershop a hairdresser a nail salon catering business clothing flashing line import export company okay is it a service-based business is it to do with marketing accounting counseling therapy um, building services so once you've written out what it is you're going to do and this only needs to be a paragraph long the next step is to detail your particular skills your experience and expertise or the skills of the people who will be involved in running the business now this may sound obvious but unless your skills experience and knowledge align with the business idea the business itself is unlikely to succeed you see the failure rate of small businesses is very very high it's over 75 percent of businesses that close within the first two years so look back over your employment history list all the skills you've acquired be it administration skills sales skills marketing customer service etc all your experience needs to be included because these may be invaluable skills in you running the business and of course list your qualifications your certificates or any training courses that you've attended because your business idea must match with your skills knowledge and expertise and if you don't have a skill set necessary you need to think about getting someone with the skill set that you lack be it in marketing sales or administration so these are the first two steps one must take in terms of setting up a business you must decide what it is you're going to do and then you must do your business plan and the um, idea and your skills are the first two stages in drafting the business plan more videos on this particular subject coming real soon please share please subscribe